Local woman and her daughter experiencing homelessness are trying to get the word out about their stolen car. Jennifer Jackson says she and her young daughter, Cora, lost their Section 8 transitional housing earlier this summer and had been living out of their car ever since. Jackson says that car was given to them by Cora's father to keep them off the streets. She says, fortunately, she was able to secure some money for a few nights in a motel in late July, but during her stay at the Motel 6 off Gateway in Springfield, their car was stolen. To add insult to injury, she says surveillance cameras may have caught the theft, but Motel 6 had difficulties pulling it up on their monitors. It was hard. It was more hard for me to have to tell my daughter. And it truly traumatized my daughter that whoever took our car took her safe place, her only safe place. Whoever took my car, just please give it back. I just want my car back. I want my daughter to feel safe again. Now, the car is a black 2011 Ford Focus SES. It is similar to the one in this photo. The only pictures she has are of the temporary license plate. Springfield police are aware of the car theft. Although we could not obtain any surveillance footage, the general manager for Motel 6 says they are reviewing whatever footage they now have of that night and plan on sending it to Springfield police today. So far, people have been commenting on possible sightings. My car was seen in Cresswell three days ago, headed southbound I-5, doing about 90 miles an hour, about took out a truck, and then got off at Cottage Grove. So a lot of the comments are made that the car has been seen a lot in Cresswell and Cottage Grove. We did reach out to Springfield Police for any more details they may have, and we're still waiting to hear back.